With over 90 different swell bottle styles and company revenue that had exceeded $50 million in one year, it's safe to say that most people like their swell water bottles. But what is the science of a swell bottle? And like many of the other water bottles, is it better or is it the same? It was founded by Sarah Kloss to eliminate plastic bottle usage and 10% of the profits go to the Water Aid Charity. The actual swell bottle is going to be capable of holding water cold for 24 hours and not for 12 hours. But how does the swell bottle do this? The bottle is made with 18-8 fuel grade stainless steel using a double wall design. 18-8 is a common alloy used in stainless steel. It is called 18 8 because it's 18% cronium. Cronium is so brittle and that's what it is. You should never drop a swell bottle. An 8% nickel. Another interesting design fact is that it has no enamel coating and it is BPA free and toxin free, which exceeds DDA regulations. According to a market research and consumer report, they tested the efficiency of a swell water bottle. They started off by filling up the average generic water bottle of 40 degree Fahrenheit water and the swell bottle with the same temperature. After 5 hours, drastic differences in the results. The average water bottle read 79 degrees, as the swell bottle read 41 degrees. I can verify this because I took the swell bottle to an 8 hour camp and the water stayed cold from 8 o'clock to 4 o'clock and all the way through the night as opposed to when I used to bring one of those regular hard plastic ones. But should we be investing in these expensive water bottles? Well, there is a substantial difference between the other stainless steel bottles, but they do stay cold for a couple hours longer. But if you need to stay cold for a little while, then the other brands are the way to go. But if you like it cold all day long, then Swell is of course the way to go. Hope you guys enjoyed our video, and please like and subscribe for more. Also, please check out our new website that we have created. Bye!